This computer is just finishing up a factory restore before being given to a new owner. I want to safely shut this computer down when the factory restore process is complete. But I want to shut it down before the Windows setup process is complete because I would like the new owner of this computer to be able to turn it on and go through the setup process of Windows just as if they would do if they purchased the computer brand new and turned it on for the very first time. After the Windows factory reset process is complete and shows a screen where a user can enter information to set up Windows, I am ready to shut down the computer so that the new owner of this computer will see this screen when he turns on this computer for the very first time, just like turning on a brand new computer. Now this is where I would like to shut down the computer so that when the new owner turns on this computer, he will see this screen where he can set up Windows. But some people have reported that holding down the power button at this stage will not cause the computer to shut down. If that's the case, then go to your keyboard and hold down the Shift, Function, and F10 keys. You'll see a command prompt open. In the command prompt, type the command that you see on your screen, which is shut down, space, forward slash, lowercase t, space, zero space forward slash s and then press enter and your computer will shut down so that the next time it's turned on by the new owner they will see the windows setup screen